Hi students, now we are watching 8th class mathematics, X is 8.3. The X is 8.3 deals with the cross multiplication of equations. Why, why do we use cross multiplication? To simplify the and to reduce the equations to the linear form. Generally equations means uh, there is to be in the X, is X power square, X power 3, anything, right? But linear equations are having the power of 1 only. So, in this exercise, we are going to reduce the equations to linear form. We are going to reduce the equations to linear form. How? By cross multiplication. Okay, let's see the exercise. Solve the following equations. 2x minus 3 by 2x plus 1 which is equals to 3x plus 1 by 3x minus 1. This is the problem. Now, can we divide these two? No. So, first let us multiply these two. Cross multiplication means this numerator with the RHS denominator. LHS denominator with the RHS numerator. Like that. Like that only. No. See, if uh, division goes right side means it will become multiplication. Same problem. Same thing. But here we are mentioning it as a cross multiplication. So, 3x minus 1 into 2x minus 3 which is equals to 3x plus 1 into 2x plus 1. Let us simplify on both the sides. 3 to 6x square, 3x into minus 3, 3 3 is minus 9x. Minus 2x, 1 into 3, 3, again, 3 to 0, 6x square plus 3x plus 2x plus 1, right? 3 to 0, 6x square, 3x into 1, 3x, 1 into 2x, 2x, 1 into 1, 1, 6x square, minus 9, minus 2, minus 11x plus 3, which is equals to? 6x square plus 5x plus 1. Okay. Let us bring everything on to the LH left hand side. 6x square minus 11x plus 3 minus 6x square minus 5x minus 1 is equals to 0. Plus 6x square minus 6x square got cancelled. Minus 11x minus 5x. How much it will be? Minus 16x. 3 minus 1. <coughs> 2. Is equals to 0. Minus 16x. I am sending 2 to the right hand side. So it will be minus 2. Minus minus cancel. x is equals to 2 by 16. 2 ones, 2 8. It means the value of x is 1 by 8. Now second problem. means b 4x minus 12 by 3x minus 7 is equals to 0 cross multiplication now here no you should not do like this because there is no denominator here so keep or, or else you can write it as 0 by 1 4x minus 12 into 1 is 4x minus 12 is equals to 3x minus 7 into 0 means 0. Okay. Now 4x minus 12 going right side means 0 plus 12. So 4x is equals to 12. What will the x value now? 4 ones, 4 threes. Therefore x value is 3. Next C. 0 0.4x minus 0 0.5 by 0 0.3 
x plus 0 0.2 which is equals to 2 by 5. First solve the expression here itself. Make it in the dis um, numeral forms. 4 by 10 x minus 5 by 10 whole divided by 3 by 10 x plus 2 by 10 is equals to 2 by 5. Both the denominator is same. It means 4x minus 5 by 10 whole divided by 3x plus 2 by 10 which is equals to 2 by 5. 10, 10 cancel. 4x minus 5 by 3x plus 2 equals to 2 by 5. Now do the cross multiplication. 5 into 4x minus 5 which is equals to 2 into 3x plus 2. 4 5 is a 20x minus 5 5 is a 25 which is equals to 3 2 is a 6x. 2 2 is a 4. Now bring x on left hand side and 20 and take 25 on to the right hand side. 20x minus 6x is equals to 4 plus 28. 25. 20 minus 6 is 14x is equals to 25 plus 4, 29, x is equals to 29 by 14, so x is 29 by 14, <clears throat> let us do the d, x square minus x plus 5 into x minus y whole divided by x minus 5 which is equals to 3 by 7. <coughs> now, do the cross multiplication. 7 into x square minus x plus 5 into x minus 5 divided yeah is equals to 3 into x minus 5 right now how is it a plus b into a minus b answer will be a square minus b square so 7 into x square minus a square minus b square means 5 square equals to 3x minus 15 x square minus x square minus 25 which is equals to 3x minus 15. Now multiply with negative um, minus here. 7 into x square minus x square minus into minus plus 25 is equals to 3x minus 15 plus x minus x go, cancel. 25 7s. And 5 is 35. 7 2 is 14. 14 plus 3, 17. So 175 equals to 3x minus 15. I am just reversing the content. 3x minus 15 equals to 175. Now 3x is equals to 175 plus 15. So 3x is equals to how much it will be? 0, 190. Therefore, x is equals to 190 by 3. Understand how to simplify the equations by using the cross multiplication? Like that, do the remaining all. I explained up to D. Solve the remaining 5 problems. Now second problem. Before explaining the second problem, let me explain you something. 45. It's a two digit number or not? Of course. 54. It's a two digit number. What is the difference in the in these two numbers? Hmm? Both are say, uh, sorry. 45 is a reverse of 54 right and 54 is the reverse of 45 what correct or not 
and what is the difference between these two numbers just one now 29 92 what is the difference between these two numbers seven right now second question is something like they are going to tell about two digit number and the difference between these two numbers by using all those <coughs> things we have to find out what is that two digit number what are the two digit numbers we have from 10 to 99 all are two digit numbers okay but don't worry it's simple only we can calculate easily the sum of the digits of a two digit number is 13 sum of the numbers it means here see 2 plus 9 is 11 11 right in the same way what they are saying, the sum of the two digit numbers is 13. Okay, let us assume. <coughs> tens place, ones place. Ten, I am going to assume tens place as a x. And ones place as 13 minus x. Because the sum is 13, no? The, when you add those two numbers, the sum is 13. So, I am going to take ones place as a 13 minus x. Now, original number, original number, how can we get this, suppose 29 is there, how will get 29, when we write in the 10 and 1 plus 2 into 9 is 18, no, or 2 plus 9, it's 11, no, how will we get 29, 2 into 10, because 2 is in the tens place, plus 9. So, 2 into 10 is 20 plus 9. So, you will get 29 like this. In the same way, I am going to multiply x with 10 because x is in the 1's place plus 13 minus x into 1. 10 into 1, 10x plus 13 minus x. 10x minus x, 9x plus 13. So, this is the original number. Okay. Next, the number formed by interchanging the digits means swapping these two places is 45 more than the original number. So, interchanging these two, tens place, ones place. So, 13 minus x will be in the tens place, x will be on the ones place. Okay, now form the number. Which number? Interchanging number. Same way. 13 minus x into 10 plus x into 1. 130 minus 10x plus x. Then it will be 130 minus 9x. Okay. <clears throat> Last point. Uh, interchanging the, the number formed by interchanging the digits is 45 more than the original number. More means addition, additional. It means, which example we took 29. Okay, the, when we swap, the value is 92, right? What is the difference between 92 and 29? 12 minus 9, 3 and 8 minus 2, some 6. So, 63 difference is there, no? So, in the same way, so it is 63 more than the 63 more, the 29 plus 63 is 92. Okay, in the same way, what they are saying, the interchanging number is 45 more than the original number. And the original number karna adi 45 ekku unnanta. Therefore, 130 minus 9x is how much more than? 45 more than original number. Let us write the original number here. 9x plus 13. Okay. Now, <clears throat> bring x's on one side and numbers on the another side. I am taking 9x on to this side. So, that we will get a positive number. 130 minus 45 minus 13 is equals to 9x plus 9x. So, let us subtract it. 
What is the value of this? 72 equals to 18x. I am just swapping the numbers. So, 18x is equals to 72. What is the value of x will be? 72 by 18. 18 ones, 18 fours. Therefore, x is 4. So, what we said? Tens plus ones plus x and 13 minus x. So, tens plus is 4 and ones plus is 13 minus 4. 13 minus 4. How much it will be? 9. Therefore, the number is? Therefore, the number is 49. Understand? Same way. Third one. The sum of the digits of two digit number is 11. The sum of the digits of two digit number is 11. Tens place, ones place. I am going to assume tens place as a x. The sum is 11 no? So, the other number might be 11 minus x. Now, I am going to write original number. Original number how much? x into 10 plus 11 minus x. So, 10x plus 11 minus x. It will be 9x plus 11. So, this is my original number now. The number obtained by adding 4 to this number is 41 less than the reversed number. Now, first write the reverse number. Reverse number. Eleven minus six x. Ten into eleven minus six plus x. Ten into eleven one ten minus ten x plus x. It will be one ten minus nine x. Now observe the condition. The number obtained. See first the sum of the two digit number is eleven. The number obtained by adding four to this number is. 41 less than the reversed number. So, for this number, if we add 4, then, then it will be 41 less than to this number. Let us add that. 9x plus 11 plus 4 is equals to 110 minus 9x minus 41. Less than 41. No, they said. Now, 9x plus 15 is equals to 110 minus 41. How much it will be? 69 minus 9x. Right? I am going to take 9x on the LHS. 9x plus 9x is equals to 69 minus 15. So, 18x is equals to 69 minus 15, 9 minus 5, 4, 6 minus 1, 5. X is equals to 54 by 18, 18 a ones, 18 threes. So, X is 3 and 11 minus X. It means 11 minus 3. How much it will be? 9. Therefore, the number is? 39. Understand? Now, last problem in this exercise. The denominator of your fraction is 4 more than the numerator. The denominator of your fraction is 4 more than the numerator. So, write, write step by step. Let us assume numerator is <coughs> x okay therefore the denominator how much the denominator will be 
x plus 4. Why x plus 4? They have given uh, the denominator of your fraction is 4 more than the numerator. So, 4 more than the numerator. Now, if the numerator is increased by 2, means x plus 2, and denominator is decreased by 5, it means x plus 4 minus 5. The fraction obtained is 5 by 12, which will be equals to 5 by 12. Now, we have to find the fraction, right? x plus 2 by x minus 1, minus 5 plus 4, divided by 5 by 12. Cross multiplication, 12x plus 24 is equals to 5x minus 5. Take x on one side. And number on the other side. 12x minus 5x is equals to. Uh, excuse me. It was uh, increased by 5. Not decreased by 5. So it will be plus 9. Okay. 5x plus 45. Now I am taking 5x on the LHS. 45 minus 24. 7x is equals to 45, 24. 15 minus 4. Sorry, 5 minus 4 is 1. 4 minus 2 is 2. 21. So, x is equals to 21 by 7. 7 ones, 7, 3. Therefore, x is 3. Means numerator is 3. Therefore, the number is equals to x by x plus 4. It is 3 by 7. Understand? By this the exercise 8 is also completed. In the next video I will explain the next, next exercise. Bye.